Hello, I'm Matt, and welcome back to Workshop. I thought I'd have a go at Summer's Woodworking's 2x4 challenge, so let's get started. For the challenge, I've decided to make something I've needed for the shop for ages anyway, and that's some stackable wooden tool chests. You can never have enough organisation in the shop, and I don't have enough wall space to put everything on, so these should help with difficult to store items like hand planes. I split my 2x4 into three equal pieces, and then I'm ripping it down in half again. I want the crate to be one and a half times the height of a 2x4, so half the wood I'm ripping down in half again. I know, that does sound like a lot of halves, but it does make sense to me. I'm just chopping some smaller pieces to use for the end pieces of the crate. And yes, it is in half again. I've lent my compressor and my brad nailer to a friend, so everything had to go together with a hammer and nails. Why do I ever do favours for people? There's going to be no fancy joinery on this, just the glue and the nails, but I'm going to add some braces later, so hopefully it'll be strong enough. I want these crates to be able to stack together, so I've cut some strips of wood to use as feet. And I'm gluing and nailing them on, inset from the sides and the ends, so they're stacking the crate below them. With it all put together, I give it all a sand. I don't go too fine on the grits, as it is a tall crate at the end of the day. I didn't want to leave the wood bare, as wood in a workshop I think can get tatty in no time. So I'm going to apply some ebony stain to the outside of the cases. I'm going to leave the inside natural, so it has a nice contrast, and is still nice and easy to see the tools. I know it's only workshop furniture, but I still want it to look nice. Now I'm installing the bracing I was talking about. I managed to find all chrome hardware, which I think looks nice against the black. On the top corners, I've got some L brackets, and on the bottom corners, I've got some corner braces. These will all add some added strength and durability, but I also think they just look cool. For the ends I installed some nice big chunky cabinet handles, also in chrome. These make it nice and easy to move these cases around. I didn't need that ruler anymore anyway. One last detail, I need to know what I've actually put in them. So I've got some chrome card holders to go on one side. Then I can slide a bit of cardboard in and label each case. This should help a little, but I feel shop organisation is a job that's never done. Recently I've been buying old planes on eBay and restoring them, so I needed somewhere to keep them neatly. And this challenge has given me an excuse to make something. That's it all done. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe for more videos.